Previously on the Best Fuck Friends Super Fun Video Game Show. We are on the last mission, <laughs> uh, the General Assembly mission. But what the fuck did he just throw at you, Mitch? Uh, a wub wub grenade? A wub 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 wub. No, I wanted to die. Why did you kill me? Bring me back. <laughs> <laughs> this is your punishment. Ooh, I got purple rain armor. Purple rain. Good night, sweet prince. <laughs> 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 I know, right? It's not like that's what I've been doing for the past, oh, eight months. Only eight? I'm gonna get my money's worth. That helicopter just showed up awful quick. <laughs> Hi, guys. It's me. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my God. They're eating her. <laughs> yeah, they're gonna eat me. Oh, yes. Oh, my God. <laughs> yes! What up, copter? Time for drill. Uh, uh, no, 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 no. I'm so happy you know that reference. <laughs> um, Brandon, let me know when you're at a uh, thingy, because I'm at one, too. Alright, um, I should begin there or soon. Mitch or Amanda. Nope, Mitch, you're just gonna go the hard way, huh? That's right. Mitch, shoot the APC, it'll work. <laughs> um, alright, activate it. Yep. Bip. Oh man, it's mad. Oh. oh, it's so mad. Oh, it's so mad. Oh, it's so mad. I've got reinforcements incoming. Keep them under pressure. Oh, Jesus. Brandon? Brandon, you calling? Is it okay? Uh, maybe. Damn, I mean, we. Oh, he's we, mad. We did some twerk on that thing, though. Dude, we twerked. I might have sticky bombed him, too. Brandon, I'm activating the next one. Uh, do it. I can't. I haven't been able to move yet. Ooh. Did you put a flashbang on it? Yep. Send off. Send off the goal. No, no, no. That'll. That's. That'll do. That works. Things. That'll do. Huh? I, I like how Benitez is telling me to take cover. Like, dude, you're a fucking New York City policeman. You know nothing of like military of grade combat. Yeah. yeah. Like, you know nothing of this. Shut your fucking fat mouth. I mean. Maybe like did the turret man just to shoot helicopter down a combat comes up and ow, you know, ow, ow, New York ow. City police oh work. Oh god, I can't see what I'm doing. And I'm down. Oh, because they all came out of where I was fucking standing. Amanda, here. Oh, we got the armor out. I think. Yes. Yes. Bitch, it looks cool, but it doesn't do anything, bro. I know, but I don't know what else to do. Uh, fair enough. <laughs> uh, there are foot soldiers around here somewhere now. Uh, yeah, I'm going for Amanda right now. Yeah, that's where they all came from. Oh. Yeah, oh, that's no. why I got fucked. Oh, oh, no. Oh, uh, no. They're not here now. Oh, no, they're still outside, trust me. Oh, no, I mean, they're not, like, all having a condo line party. On where my did ass, my... Like, did before. you say they're not having a Condoleezza <laughs> Rice party? <laughs> no, a Condoleezza <laughs> party. I swear to God, I heard Condoleezza Rice. Yeah. Sure. <laughs> Amanda, I'm gonna go for that double revive on you. It's gonna oh, take a minute though. Where's the hit? No, helicopter, oh, wow. no shooting. I just hit almost 100k on him. Stay on him Damn, Brandon. Damn, son. Damn, man, Brandon. Did that actually do something? What, the sticky mo or the flashbang? Yeah. No, the flashbang does no damage. I thought it did some damage. I'm fairly certain it says in the description that it doesn't do any damage, but I could be wrong. In the event that I'm wrong, I didn't say that, and you don't have any proof that I did. Surely that, surely the flashbang will blind the helicopter. That's how, that's, yes, that's how mechanics work. Yay! I get it. <laughs> yeah, you know, don't, but don't take it out during the day. It's very photosensitive. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, all the turrets down? Do we have to actually yeah. shoot this thing down? Yeah, yeah. Now, now we have to shoot it down. Once again, Benitez, I don't think you understand what, what, what it's taking to do that. You're saying that, uh... Also, the finale... The finale to this game is a flying helicopter, but the incursion is a stationary APC. Yeah, you know. 
Uh, I just thought of that. Well. Mitch? Yeah. Mitch, no. I'm running through the fire and the fudge to get you. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> through the fire and the fudge, we will press on. Through the fire and the fudge, I'll pick you up. Uh. Uh oh. I guess through the fire and the fudge, you will push in. <laughs> yeah. Double revive all the way. What does, what it, does mean? it mean? <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh boy. I like how you guys have just been running around the outside. I'm just like, hey, I'm going to sit in the middle where it's like one of the two places is actually covered from well, the helicopter. Well, I've been running around... Uh, I've been <laughs> running around on the outside because I had to pick up Amanda and then Mitch. Oh, oh, Colonel oh, Bliss. Man. Oh, you oh. went out so non-blissfully. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh -huh. Uh -huh. <laughs> oh my god, I just watched a JTF man get raped. Oh. I feel like I feel like you would endure some trauma from that. I'm good, Mitch. From watching someone get raped? Yeah, like watching one man rape another man, like right in front of you, <laughs> like uh, prison uh, rule style. Traumatic. Who are the two men? A JTF officer and a PMC contractor, <laughs> or I guess PMC and contractor are the same thing. Anyways, <laughs> just call yeah, back military to me. contractor, contractor. Yeah. He contracts to private military contracts. <laughs> He's a private military subcontractor. <laughs> of division contractors. Of right. the division of contractors. Oh my god, what a douche. Who goes up in there? And who just sits there, like... Did you get him? Oh, yeah, he's dead now. It's like, stand up. Oh, shit. Oh, hello. Whoa! Oh, wow, he ran into it. He must really have wanted it. I mean, probably. Who, would? Who wouldn't? <laughs> I don't know why, but I thought you were going to say who let the dogs out. Who? 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 Who let the dogs yeah, out? Yeah, we did it on the first try? With what? no deaths? Are you sure we're playing? My no, meter not. is ecstatically hard right now. Ecstatically. <laughs> uh, I don't know if I know what those words mean. <laughs> Ooh, we're going to go do Falcon Lost now, right? Uh, no. <laughs> well, shit. Um, wow. That was it. Yeah, we nice. done did it, guys. Our very first full playthrough. <gasps> and I use the word full in air quotes. <laughs> but we at least played through all of the story missions uh, in the division. So um, yep. that, was, that was fun, though. I, I mean, I enjoyed the missions. Definitely. I loved it. I didn't enjoy the butt rape that came with some of them. But, uh, <laughs> you know, you, you win some, you lose some, then you uh, you get tucked in at night. Not so I guess we need to go back to the base now, right? Uh, is it the base of operations that we go to? Yes. Amanda? Amanda? Yeah. Why is my thing set to you? You left me. That's right. <laughs> I don't have the mission. Do we go back to the base of operations? I think so. I think I we know. go to the exit first. Oh, well, I just teleported back to the base of operations, so you guys take Oh, care. I missed a purple rain item. What? Gotta get oh, that rain, son. Yeah, I think you're right, actually. Oh, no. Can I not get up there? Oh, here we go. Guys, all the competency points that we just racked up, gone. <laughs> <laughs> Much like uh, that rocket league episode. <laughs> all of my cred. Oh, man. It, there was so much plowing. Uh, I will say, it'll, it will be nice to uh, go back to some other games, though. Because this, this game is fun. And uh, oh. I, I, oh, will, yeah. I wouldn't mind continuing on, uh, on our other characters that are... Uh, Level 30, maybe doing some Dark Zone playthroughs, maybe doing the Incursion. Yeah, That sounds yeah. pretty awesome, actually. The Incursion would be fun as fuck. Oh, yeah, dude. But, uh... Totally. But, yeah, I'm, uh... I'll be excited to get back into some other games. I definitely want to check out Brawlhalla, see if they added anything more. I think they just had an update. I'm, I might be wrong, but I'm pretty sure they just had an update for it pretty recently. I'm trying to think of something sexual for update, but it's not coming to me, man. Like Suck date? Man. <laughs> Damn, Mitch is on point tonight. Yeah, he is. He is. I hate that. I'm not mad. I'm just disappointed. You're, you're a little mad, John. I'm, no, I'm not mad. I'm disappointed. In me, mostly. 
Um, so have you guys gotten the mission or anything? I have not yet. I'm following a waypoint to somewhere. No, that's to Amanda. You're not gonna. Get, she's at the base <laughs> of operations. I to mean, him? you can keep, you can keep following it, I guess. Oh, there's the mission. Ah, oh. fuck! I just, I just did fast travel. I just had to walk through the base. The uh, yeah, walk into the base. Oh, I'm gonna drip buckets on you, Brandon. Is that a bad thing? Uh, well, it depends on how much free time you have, because it's going to take a long-ass time to drip a bucket. Pretty good team, I think. Done a lot yeah, there's that last uh, little sort of mission. Yeah. And I, both know this isn't exactly a happy and I can't fast travel to the... Homicidal traitor Aaron Keener is still ah, there. there we go. Oh. Well, Breezy, I'm fast traveling to you. Breezy, I'm... I'm just going to feel you. I'm fast traveling to John. And we don't know where Amherst is either, or what else he might have up his sleeve, but... So I don't know where it's going to drop me then. <laughs> Everywhere and nowhere all in the, the ocean. same time. <laughs> in the little ocean, die immediately. <laughs> you broke the LMBs back, and the cleaners, and the Rikers too. Oh yeah, my cousin. Like, the, the list goes on, bitch. I broke a lot of backs. <laughs> I got my back broken. The whaling division. I'm not gonna go back to sleep after this. Second wave, don't you think? Confirmed. Um. Unidentified shade tech beacon located. All right, I'm, I'm just, walking through the door. I'm just gonna roll the dice on this one. I don't know where it's gonna put me. I like. Uh, it was right here this whole time. Right where we started. <gasps> Oh my god. I like how this creener or whatever this guy's name is, he he put up a lot of a lot of plastic. To then just die in the end. <laughs> Oops, spoiler. Actually this ending little bit well, I'll let everyone experience it. Here I am, Aaron Keener, the first wave's prodigal son. Normally I'd do this face to face, but I'm not 100% sure which way you'll jump. You act one way when Ms. Lao is watching, and another way entirely when you're off the leash. That's an interesting contradiction. You see, I think that deep down, you get it. You know, the old rules, laws, governments, those things died on Black Friday. But the feral PMCs, the convicts, the ones smart enough and good enough to take what they need, they'll survive. Me? I'm gonna prosper. Oh, you could too, but you took an oath, right? You got a duty. Those are both ways of saying that your conscience is fucking you. You ask yourself, who has earned a right to tell you what to do? Do you know how many agents died? The whole the dark zone, just for the brass to give up and put a wall around it. You don't believe me? You should check the place out for yourself. My god, this is miserable. But yeah. the people you're working for, they're irrelevant now. Amherst changed how the game is played, and I have got the vision to win. I got Chernenko, I got a DNA printer, and a very interesting recipe book. I'm gonna write my own rules. You should think about getting in on this thing. I'll be seeing you. I'm glad the door is in the... <laughs> it, is, it is in the fucking Echo. <laughs> All right. That's it, right? I think so. Oh, wait. I got one new evidence. Oh, yeah. yeah but we've got some more information. Oh. A voice from the grave. Listen to what Amherst has to say. All right, let's watch it. What you're looking at is the smallpox virus, one of the deadliest pathogens on the planet. For centuries, it did a wonderful job of helping keep the human population in check. But times change, and sometimes Mother Nature needs a hand in improving her creations. Like, say, speeding them up a little bit. 
making them contagious when they should be quietly incubating in a host, or making them more lethal. I didn't come up with the approach on my own. My friend Vitaly is one of the pioneers in the field, and the idea has been around for years. Genome as data. You see, once we digitized DNA, we made it infinitely mutable. We could do a thousand virtual variations in the time it used to take to grow a one lab grade generation of pathogens. And we could pick the best, most lethal combinations and make them real. That's how you make a killer virus, you see. Mix in genetic code from other diseases and you move the sliders all the way up on lethality and virulence. The goal was a 90% mortality rate. I'm not sure my green poison is going to quite hit that, but honestly, that's just details. As long as most of humanity goes, the Earth stands a fighting chance. Technically, technology is what's killing the planet. But that's not really the case. It's the greed that drives the technology. But a funny thing happened on the way to $100 genome maps and 3D printed plastic toys. Someone figured out those technologies could be repurposed, modified for the greater good. Me. Now, my virus is gonna do what nature's always done. Decide who lives and who dies. And if nature decides I die, then I die. If nothing else, I'll have a lot of company. Natural selection at its finest. Helped along by a little unnatural genetic manipulation. It's all data, really. Life's just a method of processing it. The same way I processed the smallpox genome on my laptop. And who's to say that wasn't the plan all along? If, by some miracle, you survive green poison, then nature's decided you deserve to live. The rest of us shouldn't and won't. Godspeed. I'll see you in hell. All right. That wasn't morbid. No, yeah. not at all. I mean, I mean, I'll see you in hell when we play Doom. <laughs> <laughs> uh... All right. Well, hey, thank you so much for checking out our full playthrough of The Division. Uh, and make sure you guys stick back stick back around on the channel because we're going to have more coming your way. Absolutely. Mitch, feel like Mitch it. say good night, Mitch. Good night, fans. Brandon, say good night. Good night, sweet friends. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> oh, I got the double revive. Oh. <laughs> uh, you can't even die, right? <laughs> 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 the last and ultimate failure. Uh, Amanda, say goodbye. Don't be rude. Amanda! What? Say goodbye. Goodbye. Thank you. You're welcome. And watch me beat this street peasant. Nope. <laughs> damage damage resistance. This is why I don't say goodbye, because shit like this happens. <laughs> 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 Hi, John. <laughs> <laughs> oh wow, I can't even. Well, you myself. can't even kill yourself either, John. At God, least I'm I such a failure. So. <laughs> can I not? Yes, that's true. No. Ah, yes. No, no don't don't revive him. Nobody will to. revive me. <laughs> <laughs> We'll see you guys later. Bye, guys. Hey, guys. We're all really excited that we got our first full playthrough completed for the channel. We're going to have some more Dark Zone content soon, but for now, we're going to be switching back and showing some more Brawlhalla, Rocket League, and a few other games that we haven't done on the channel yet. So definitely stay tuned for that. Thank you again so much for checking out these videos, and we will catch you guys in the next one.